Hello everybody, today we shall be looking at the Indian game of chess, one of my favourite openings, favourited by most grandmasters, absolute unit of an opening. Today we shall be looking at the Indian game. First of all, start us off with d4 and we shall respond knight to f6. The whole point being is you prevent this pawn from coming here. And our next couple of moves will be uh, hopefully pawn here. Uh, Pawn here, maybe. Pawn here. Uh, today I shall be covering the King's Indian Defence, which is one of the most solid openings in the game. So, most common reply is this, in which you shall reply with this. And then most of the time they will go here, which you will reply, which you will reply going here. And it says the on the eval bar that this is uh, winning for white, but I don't think it is. And then... Most of the time, people will go here, okay, which we will respond by going here. See, the the whole point of the Indian is to let uh, White develop a big uh, center, and we have to slowly, slowly crush it, I guess. Um, so we go here, and White can push this pawn, uh, which will be a blunder, I think, actually, because uh, boom, I'll show you. Uh, so boom, takes, takes. And then we take this, and we are simply up by 0. Point, sorry, something's in the way, 0 0.8, I think. And so that will be a huge mistake by white. And our next couple of moves will be simply, uh, if they go here, which is uh, quite scary, uh, after here, and go here. Uh, this is four pawns attack, this is quite scary, actually, which we will reply by going... I can't remember the reply actually. I'm pretty sure that um, knight here is okay, but I might be wrong. Knight here. Let's look at the evil bar. Apparently not. I think after boom, takes, takes, yeah. I don't think that's right. Um, <laughs> let me think of a reply straight off the bat. Um, after the follow up, four pawns attack. Um, I'm pretty sure, sorry about the noise. So I'm pretty sure after uh, pawn here, I'm not actually sure what the right move is. Sorry, I should know. I'm pretty sure that you're just fine after you castle. I think so. Yeah, I'm pretty sure you're just fine after you castle, so castling is probably uh, an alright option. Uh, so, four pawns attack, quite scary. But most of the time you won't have to deal with that. So after pawn here, you simply put the bishop here, and most of the time you'll probably get knight to here, which is an okay move. And then we simply just castle. And our main point is to slowly uh, strike in the center, strike back in the center, because as you can see, uh, white has a, a big center, and we don't like that. So we're gonna go for the BBC, big black center. Uh, and sometimes you can put the bishop here in the Ind Indian game. Uh, there is a line called the Queen's Indian Defense, which is uh, quite similar to that. But anyway, so most commonly the move here is here, which is a fine move. Uh, we will respond by putting our knight here, the whole point being to strike in the center. And then in the next couple of moves here to strike in the center, they will most likely castle. And I'm pretty sure. Uh, Evil Bar will critique me if this uh, this is the right move. So we strike back in the center, uh, gaining a BBC, a big black center, which we uh, they will take. We will take, and then you know we're all good. Um, but usually you want to bring the bishop out here somewhere uh, before we create a BBC. But that is the Indian game. Uh, King's Indian. I'll actually quickly show you uh, that that was quite quick. Uh, it's five minutes, so I'll I'll really quickly show you uh, another tutorial really quickly, so like extra quickly. So D4 knight here and then here and then here. This is called the two knights tango. They will apply here. We go here, and then the whole knight being uh, the whole point being is that we try get the knight here to here and then we go here, preventing any bishop here ideas. And as you know, two knights here can only mean trouble for white. And it's just a sweet and smooth sound game. You slowly try to uh, you slowly try to get the bishop out, uh, get both bishops out. Uh, 
quite simple, quite effective, uh, quite effective. Uh, I might be completely wrong, but um, that's what I usually do. Sometimes you will get this, which is uh, the horsefly gambit, which is a hilarious name, uh, which you will simply apply by taking the pawn, and you have quite a smooth game, and you can just push this pawn to defend this. Uh, but if they put pawn here, then you just put uh, you don't want to push the pawn. Uh, you mostly want to go back and just try and get the knight here somehow because that's the whole point of the two knights tango. Alright.